Coronavirus cases are on the rise nationwide, and so are concerns about the effectiveness of one of the vaccines against the Delta variant. News Channel 3's Madison Weil has the latest from local health experts. A new study suggesting that the Johnson & Johnson vaccine might not be as effective against the Delta variant as Pfizer or Moderna. I spoke with the chief medical officer at Eisenhower Health to learn more about what they're advising for the community. According to a new medical study reported in the New York Times, the Johnson & Johnson vaccine is, quote, much less effective against the Delta and Lambda variants than against the original virus. Dr. Alan Williamson at Eisenhower Health says while there is some concern over J&J's effectiveness, it still provides significantly more protection than being unvaccinated. You know, overall, we're, we're still seeing extraordinarily high effectiveness of these vaccines. For people who are concerned about the Johnson & Johnson vaccine, would you recommend they also get vaccinated with Pfizer or Moderna at this time? Uh, that's a very good question. And at this point, uh, there is not much data to really suggest that it would be worthwhile to start over again in essence and become revaccinated. The new medical study agreeing with those words. Although the authors go on to suggest that those vaccinated with Johnson and Johnson might ultimately quote need to receive a second dose, ideally of one of the mRNA vaccines made by Pfizer or Moderna. Dr. Williamson says the larger concern for them right now is the number of young people coming in with serious COVID symptoms, largely because here in the Valley, vaccine rates are higher among the elderly. The cases that we will see with this variant, unfortunately, are likely to be younger people because they're the ones that are unvaccinated. With the Delta variant proving more contagious and other variants potentially on the horizon, he hopes anyone unvaccinated reconsiders. Madison Weil News, Channel 3.